third here in the Eagles Nest, where we in practice integrity, excellence, and teamwork every single day. And guys, I especially think that is very important today when we're outside and we're in our stations and we're competing against our classmates. We still want to show integrity. We want to do the right thing even when no one's looking. We want to show excellence excellence even when playing and then of course teamwork we want to express teamwork in everything that we do if you don't win one game it's okay it's okay try again for the next one so guys i am looking for classes that are showing integrity excellence and teamwork all day today during field day and i know you can do it all right friends which harry potter are you feeling today it's field day. I'm a number nine. Let's do it. I'm ready. Let's go. I can't wait to see you all competing at your stations on the bounce houses during tug of war. Coach told me that he had over 20 stations today. So guys, how are you feeling? What energy are you bringing today at, at field day? Okay. And just stay tuned because I have a special guest in just one second. So which um, Harry Potter, are you feeling? Which Harry Potter are you feeling? All right, turn to your table partners and your table mates and let them know what's really going on for today. Teachers put it in the chat so we will know what to expect. <laughs> We're on the field today. All right, let's keep it moving. Let's go over our Fairview 5 that we're going to take to field day with us today. Number one, actively listen to the speaker. Number two, keep your hands and feet to yourself. Number three, clean up your area. We're gonna be out there drinking water, 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 and more water. If you have a water bottle, pick it up, throw it in the trash. We do not want a whole lot of trash on our field when we're finished. Number four, be kind to others with your words and actions. Remember what I said, if you are not the winner of one game or one station, it's okay. Move on to the next one. Don't be unkind to someone just because you didn't get what you want, guys, okay? So be kind to others with your words and actions and do your absolute best today. Give it your all and have some fun. All right. We're going to make sure we are classroom ready, hallway ready, recess ready, specials ready, and field day ready today. So make sure you carry the Fairview 5 with you today. Guys, it's field day. Let the games begin. I have someone that wants to share a couple updates with you. Good morning, guys. So I'm, something, I'm super excited about field day today. I just have a few reminders. So we do have volunteers here today, guys. They do not know you. Just show them how we conduct ourselves here at Fairview. All right, let's give these people something to talk about. I love to hear my friends text and email me like, Coach, your scholars are the best scholars. Um, other than that, guys, just come out and have fun. Your teachers are excited. Your admin is excited. I'm excited. And I hope you guys are excited. So I'll see you guys in a few. I'm out setting up for field day. When you come out, you know, make your entries, make some noise so we'll know that you're um, coming. I'll see you guys later. All right, Coach, everybody. Let's make sure when we see Coach today, he just ran out of here. <laughs> so make sure when we see Coach today, we tell him thank you. He's been planning for months to make this the best day for you all. And I really think this is probably the biggest one I've ever seen. So I'm excited about it. And again, Thank you to coach. Teachers, I will have a table set up right at the entrance for parents to check in with me before they go to you, okay? So I'm gonna have parents check in with me because I wanna make sure they're on our volunteer list before they come to you. I'm also going to remind them they are to support you. They are to help you and take whatever directions from you to make your field day successful, okay? Um, so I'll take care of all of those reminders uh, when they check in, all right, guys? If there's anything else, just let me know. If a parent dojos you and asks, where do I check in? Just say, see Miss Fuller at the top of the field. All right, I'll be right there with my purple shirt on. So I'll take care of any questions about parents. Text me or call me. All right, guys, 90% club. Here we go. Here we go. I'm excited about celebrating my 90% club. So let's get a drum roll, please. All 
All right. We have Miss Green's class, Miss Haley, Miss Reynolds, Miss Peterson, Miss Sanders, Miss Burris, Miss McLean, Mr. Langley, Miss Gilliam, Miss Walton, Dr. Morrison, Miss Lawson, Miss Esther, Miss Carter, Miss Miller, Miss Malatesta, Miss C, and Miss Alfred's class. 18 classes. Last week we had 17. This week it was 18. So give yourselves a round of applause. I am excited about you all being here in the building. I guarantee you we probably have 100% attendance today. <laughs> but it should be like that every day. Every day, guys, you should be here in the building. All right, friends, let's go to team of the month. So we have chosen a team of the month for this month, well, for the past month, the month of April, and that is... Our EL team, Mr. Newell and Miss Rodriguez. Thank you all so much. The two of them, they just make it do what it do. They're always willing to lend a helping hand. And we appreciate you here in the Equals Nest. So come on down because y'all have to run today. All right, one more thing, guys. Champion belt. Sorry, coach just came back in. We got one announcement. Okay, all volunteers, specialists, all support staff, if you have received an email from coach, meet him at 8.30 on the field. Meet him at 8.30 on the field. All right, champion belts, champion belts, here we go. Are right, y'all ready? Sit up straight, listen in, and when you hear your class's name, come on down and get your belt. All right, the first belt, the sore belt, goes to Miss Alfred's class. Come on down. The specials belt goes to Miss Sanders' class. Oh my goodness. The attendance belt goes to Miss S. Carter's class. Y'all are showing out today. The cafeteria belt, Miss Sanders' class. And the hallway belt, Miss Walton's class. Come on down, guys, and get your belt. I am super proud of you for showing the Fairview Five in all of those areas this week. And I do want to shout out Miss Carter's class, the, that attendance belt. They had 98% attendance this week. So thank you very much to that class for having the highest attendance this week. All right, Scholars of the Week, you know what to do when you hear your name. Come on down so that we can get in the hallways and celebrate you. Teachers, once I end the announcements, gather in the hallway and we're going to do what we do every single Friday and celebrate these scholars. So the first one is your steam from Miss Sanders class. Come on down. Allison from Miss Hamlin's class. All right now. You, Andre, Miss Lawson's class. Abigail from Miss Esther's class. Yo, Steen from Mr. Cassius. And Randy from Miss Morrison's class. All right. Randy is new to the nest, so congratulations. I am super proud of all of you and thankful that you are here every single day and that you were able to show us what the Fairview 5 truly looks and sounds like. So thank you very much. And I can't wait to see who's Scholar of the Week next week. I have scholars asking me all the time, Miss Fuller, can I be Scholar of the Week? Can I be Scholar of the Week? You need to show your teachers and your classmates how you can be Scholar of the Week. And you can do that just by following the Fairview Five and doing that every single day. And guess what? You have to be here. So you got to come to school in order to show your teachers that as well. All right, guys, teachers, just a couple updates. Um, you know it's field day today. We're going to be out there and we're going to be very excited Scholars, cell phones, do not go outside with us. Put those in your book bags. We don't have time to keep up with those, so you need to leave them in your book bags. If I see them, if the teacher takes them, you already know what it is. Voice level zero and traveling through the hallway, but you heard what Coach said. When you step foot on that field, he wants to hear you making some noise. All right, guys, 
Teachers, please make sure you take all your classes to the bathroom before going outside today. So please take that bathroom class, bathroom break before you go outside today. Of course, we'll have an entryway for the, um, the side cafeteria door for uh, for teachers or scholars to be able to go to the bathroom, all right? And support staff, if you received an email from Coach about um, supporting stations today, he would like you on the field by 8.30. Again, he would like you on the field by 8.30 so that we can start on time. All right, guys, I'm ready. I know you're ready, but before we leave, you know what it is. Good is good. Great is great. But elite is elite. Let's go. It is time to have some fun, guys. But I need you to stay settled before you get there. So stay calm. Stay settled. Don't get in any trouble before we go to field day. Make sure you're following the Fairview 5, even right now. I know you're excited. So I'll see you soon. Bye, guys.